guys, today I'm going to be doing a Q&A and I asked you guys to ask me questions on Instagram and some of you commented some questions. So today I'm going to be answering your guys' questions. I'm really excited to be doing this Q&A because I haven't done one in like forever. It's been a really long time so I figured that this would be a good video to do so you guys could be caught up on what's going on in my life. So let's just get right on into the questions. The first one is, what colleges slash universities are you planning to attend after high school? I wanna stay in California for sure. So yeah, I'm gonna go to college somewhere in California. What will you miss most about high school and why? I think I'm gonna miss cheer the most in high school because cheer has literally been my life for like the past four years. I've been in cheer since I was a freshman in high school. I've made so many unforgettable memories and I made so many friends and it's just a great experience. Are you going to do a vlogmas this year? Yes, I'm doing vlogmas this year guys. And comment below what song I should use for the intro for vlogmas because I don't know what Christmas song I should use so give me some suggestions. I'm going to be doing it on my main channel Beauty by Alyssa Renee because I feel like a lot of people don't know about my other vlog channel which is It's Alyssa's Life, so I'm just going to be sticking to doing Vlogmas again this year on this channel, so look out for those videos. What is your favorite memory in high school and why? Love you, Alyssa. You're amazing. Thank you, Brianna. You're amazing, too. So I'm a really indecisive person, so I'm going to list, like, a few of my favorite memories in high school. Okay, so the first one. This is going to sound really cheesy, but my favorite memory in high school is meeting Jonathan because that has changed my life like <laughs> I sound so dramatic right now <laughs> I spent half my high school experience with Jonathan and just meeting him made it so much better because everything we got to do together just made high school like a hundred times better because that was with him and yeah which leads me on to my next favorite memory in high school which would be prom because oh my gosh guys if you have an opportunity to go to prom you should go because it was like one of the funnest nights of my life. I've been to prom twice and those two times have been the best ever. I'm gonna just pick one more. Cheer, just like being involved in cheer, going to cheer camp, even though sometimes it's stressful at cheer camp, but it's really fun too. It's really fun to go to competitions and compete and we won national champions at our nationals in Vegas, so hey. And it's just really fun to be in cheer and meet so many new people and cheer at football games and basketball games and just have so many opportunities to get to cheer. So those are like my three top favorite memories in high school. I'm pretty sure I have, oh, I have one more. Okay, so my 17th birthday at school, I pulled into the parking lot and then my two best friends, Natalie and Raylene, were standing there with Starbucks and I was like, oh, how sweet. And they gave me like a card and everything with Starbucks, it was so cute. And then I walked into my first period and the first thing I saw was two balloons tied to my chair and they're just like, one of them said like princess and I forgot the other one was like some pink balloon oh, I think it said happy birthday and there was also this Pandora bag on my desk and my desk was all decorated pink and so cute and then there was also homemade red velvet cupcakes and then there's this like just like funny hat for like a birthday or whatever oh there's also a cute card there too for me and Jonathan set that up like an hour or two before school even started so that was like really sweet of him to do. That was like one of the coolest moments ever, just to walk into my first period and see all that set up for me for my birthday. So Jonathan did that for me, which was really sweet of him. I like I actually did cry because I didn't cry at first, but then this happened, which is also another one of my favorite memories in high school. Um, I walked out of first period and Jonathan was standing there along with some of my friends and he asked me to prom. He was holding the sign and said the only princess missing is you dot 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 and then five of my friends were holding P-R-O-M question mark prom. So yeah, he asked me to prom on my birthday. It was like so like perfect. It was great. A shout out to Jonathan and my best friends for making high school look great. Can you film fall favorites or a clothing haul? Actually, I just uploaded a clothing haul onto my main channel, so you guys should go check that out. That was the last video I uploaded, and it's a fall clothing haul. So I'll put the link somewhere here if you're on a laptop, you can like click my face, but I'll also put the link down below to watch that fall clothing haul video. Pick a food that you would eat for your entire life. I think I would have to go with pasta because that's my favorite food, but chicken fettuccine offered a pasta. So good. 
do you plan on cheering in college? Um, it depends what college I go to. It just all depends. Like, I kind of do want to cheer in college, but then there's a side of me that doesn't want to cheer in college, so we'll see what happens. So that's a maybe. What do you want to become when you get older? I just figured this out, so as of right now, I want to become a certified nurse and midwife. I want to become a certified nurse midwife because I love babies and I just think working with babies would be so cool and like delivering babies like into the world sounds pretty cool to me. Being able to take care of them when they're first born is just sounds so so fun to me. So yeah, I want to be a certified nurse midwife. What is your favorite breed of dog? I think my favorite breed of dog is a Yorkie Terrier. I really want a Yorkie. I heard they're really feisty, but yeah. Do you have a P.O. box? No, I do not have a P.O. box, but I can make one if you guys want me to make a P.O. box. Just comment down below if you guys would actually like send me stuff because I feel like I wouldn't get anything. So comment below if you guys would like me to get a P.O. box. How old do you think you'll be when you get married? I predict that I'll be 25. 24 or 25. That's my prediction. <laughs> we'll see what happens. Or maybe 26. I don't know. I don't know. Knock on wood. <laughs> How old are you? I am 17 years old. Favorite mascara? It's CoverGirl Lash. It's CoverGirl Lash Blast Fusion. That's really hard to say if you say that like really fast. And I get the waterproof kind. Can you give me advice about relationships? I haven't really given advice on relationships before, so this is it's gonna be new to me. But I'm gonna try my best. Okay. So advice on being in a relationship. Um, communicate. That's a big one. You have to be able to communicate with each other and trust each other. You have to trust your partner because if you don't trust them, then like, why are you in a relationship, you know? So, effort. You need to put in as much effort as you would like to get, if that makes sense. <laughs> I don't know, I got a word that weird. Um, make time for each other. Even if you have busy schedules, always try to make time for each other. Be loyal, obviously. That's like an obvious one. Be faithful. That's the advice that I have on the top of my head right now. So... Let's just stick with that. What is one makeup product you have been using the most these past months? My makeup literally stays the same all the time. So it hasn't really changed, but um, a makeup product that I've been using like for a long time now, it's a Stila Black Liquid Eyeliner. It stays on all day, it's great. Are you ready for Christmas? Heck yeah, I'm ready for Christmas. I was literally just playing Christmas music before this video. It's my favorite holiday. What is the best part about living in California for you? I think the best part about living in California is that you could literally go to the beach one day and then like go to the snow the next day. Like I'm not even kidding. It depends what area you live in. I live in Southern California. I love living in California because there's a lot of things to do here. What are your plans after high school? My plans after high school are to attend a four-year university. After I get my bachelor's of science in nursing, I'm planning to take, um, I think it's called the MCLEX RN exam to become a registered nurse. And then after that, I plan to go to a two-year midwife program. And after I finish that program, then I have to take a test. And if I pass it, then I can become a certified nurse midwife. So as of right now, those are my plans for after high school. And also, I really want to travel. Like, that's one of my biggest goals in life is just to travel around the world. I think it'd be fun if I traveled with Jonathan. Because I've always wanted to like travel with the person that I love. What are your thoughts about leaving school and going to college? Terrifying. <laughs> no, but for real, like, it really is scary. Like, I'm going into the real world. The real world. I guess you could say. And I'm kind of scared for college because it's going to be a big change in my life, but I think I'm ready. Hopefully, I think hopefully you will go. I'm excited to be growing up, but then I'm scared at the same time. If you guys are in my same position, you'll understand what I'm trying to say here. How do you get your hair so long? Honestly, I don't even do anything special to my hair. I just put shampoo and conditioner in it. If you could go anywhere in the world, where would it be and why? I would go to Bora Bora. If you guys watch Aspen and Parker, they're like my favorite YouTubers ever. Seeing their vlogs make me want to go a hundred times more because it's just so beautiful in Bora Bora. If I would go to Bora Bora, I would want to stay at the Four Seasons Resort where they stay at because you just stay in this little bungalow and it just looks so perfect and like tropical and pretty. So yeah, I want to go to Bora Bora. 
how do you plan on asking Jonathan to prom this year? Honestly, as of right now, I don't really know how I'm going to be asking him to prom because I'm a senior in high school and he's in college, so obviously I have to ask him to prom if I want him to go to my senior prom. I haven't really thought about ideas for asking him. That's probably going to take me a long time to figure out because I'm really indecisive. Do you have any goals for 2017? My goal for 2017 is to travel somewhere new, like travel to Hawaii. I really want to go to Hawaii. Another goal of mine is to obviously graduate high school and hopefully I get accepted to a good college. Basically my biggest goal is to just get my life together because 2017 is going to be a big year for change. So my camera died, so sorry if the lighting is different or if the angle is a little bit different, but I'm just going to continue with the questions now. What has been your favorite movie for fall and Christmas? So I'm just going to change like fall to Halloween. So my favorite Halloween movie is Halloween Town and my favorite Christmas movie is the Santa Claus, well the Santa Claus series because there's like three different movies. Favorite memory of you and Jonathan during high school? Well I have a lot of favorite memories of us two during high school. But if I had to pick just one, I think it would be just going to prom together. <laughs> I've said this so many times, but literally, it's so much fun dancing with him at prom and at all the dances. It's just an amazing time. And another favorite memory is just like hanging out with him at lunch all the time. I honestly miss that because he doesn't go to high school with me anymore, so. <laughs> Do you plan to always be a YouTuber and are you happy with the outcome of being a well-known YouTuber? I don't really consider myself a well-known YouTuber. But thank you for your comment, it's really sweet. I do plan on being a YouTuber for quite a while, so we'll just see where that takes me. I am really happy of the outcome of what my channel has become because honestly, I couldn't have done this without you guys watching my subscribers. You guys are amazing. I never even expected my channel to grow like this when I first started my YouTube channel. So yes, I am very happy with the way my YouTube channel has turned out. A big thank you to you guys watching. Thank you guys so much. So that was it for my q and I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you have any other questions, feel free to comment them down below in the comment section because I'll answer them. And I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye!